it doesn't get much simpler or refreshing than the Gimlet. This classic cocktail is made from gin, lime juice, and simple syrup. This drink is a great way to explore the nuances of different gins. Hi everyone, welcome to today's episode of Let's Celebrate TV Cocktail Fridays. I'm your host, Peter Lee. Today, we're making one of my favorite drinks. It's bright and refreshing and super easy to make. We're making the gin gimlet. Now, what is a gimlet? This is a very classic cocktail. Some stories say that its origins date back to the 1800s, but it's essentially just gin and sweetened lime juice. It's very refreshing. And if you don't like gin, think of this as limeade for grown-ups. And it's a great way to try out different gins and find the one that you like. So let's get started. My recipe starts with two ounces or 60 mils of, you guessed it, gin. I'm using Bombay Sapphire today. You can use whatever gin you wanna try out first or whatever gin you like. Two ounces, 60 mils. right in our glass of ice. Next is lime juice. Now use freshly squeezed lime juice, please. I have a nice hearty lime here. We just need a half an ounce or 15 mils, but fresh is best, especially in this. You don't wanna use the bottled or the bottled pre-sweetened. Fresh lime juice. Good squeeze. There we go. All right. Right in with our gin. Next, simple syrup. Simple syrup is simply equal parts of sugar and water that you heat gently until the sugar dissolves. If you don't like to do that or don't want to do it, you can get store-bought. This is the kind I have today. And we just need, again, a half an ounce or 15 mils. Right in. All righty. Now, you know what time it is. Time for the shaky shaky. Here we go. Now this is typically served in a cocktail glass in this shape. This is called a coupe. Sometimes it's referred to as a champagne saucer. All I did was to chill it. I put some ice and water in it. That'll chill it down. So let me dump this. Now we want to strain this, but we want to double strain it because I shook it. There's going to be lots of little ice crystals and I think a little more sophisticated than just having a drink full of chunky ice. So two strainers right into our chilled glass. <gasps> Looks good, huh? Now we need a little garnish. This is a lime-based drink, so I'm gonna garnish it with a little wheel of lime. How pretty is that? So let's give it a taste. Mmm, 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 mmm. That is delicious. It's bright, it's refreshing, and you know, this is kind of a stronger gin, but it matches really great with that lime, and the simple syrup just brings it all together. My new favorite, actually a current favorite, but I highly recommend making this drink. As always, we will see you on Tuesdays for our regular episodes, Fridays for Cocktail Friday, and every other Sunday for our live streams. So while I enjoy my cocktail here, I would like you to watch some of these episodes over here. Until next time, everyone. Cheers. <laughs>